Hello and welcome to this CSD video tutorial on how to create a new part. In this tutorial we will show you how to create new parts in the equipment database. The most important task for a manager is to establish and maintain the equipment database. Go to the parts dialog by clicking on this icon. Here you can create new parts, make changes to existing parts, delete parts, copy parts, and check whether parts has been used. To create a new part, press the new button. This brings you into the data dialog box. The fields with blue text are mandatory and needs to be filled out, but we strongly recommend you to register as much information as possible. Remember to choose the right symbol type and that the part is identified by the part number. Also note that the CSD scale OD is used to scale the symbol and it's important to secure a correct visual presentation in the schematic. When you press update there will be some logical checks on diameters and pressure data. ID cannot be larger than OD and test pressure must be greater than work pressure. It is not possible to register two parts with the same part number. Edit is used if you want to edit the data registered on an existing part and takes you to the data tab. If the part has been used in completions you will get a warning message reminding you that the changes will affect all the completion where the part has been used. If you need to delete the part you can use the delete button. Highlight the part you want to delete and press it. If the part has been used in a completion it cannot be deleted. You will then have to replace it or remove it from any completions. To find out where the part has been used, highlight it and go to the Usage tab. Here you will find all fields, wells and revisions where the part has been used. You can also copy an existing part. Highlight a row and press Copy. The data dialog appears and all data from the existing part has been copied except for the part number. Enter a new part number and change any data that needs to be changed. Then press update or OK to save the information. If you have documents with more information regarding the part, it is possible to attach it. This is done in the documents tab. Press new to add a new document or drag and drop the file from your folder. It is also possible to edit or change a part used in a completion from the schematic view. Highlight the item, right click and choose view part. And then you will be taken directly to the data tab for the specific part. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If any questions please get in touch with us in CSD support.